in touch with Coventry. I'm Nick Dewars. I wonder if you could correct all your mistakes. How about we do that? We'd be here for hours. <laughs> we would, especially I, if we repeat the 8.30 bulletin. Well, I know. It's, can I just say, it's because well, the air conditioning's not working and I'm far too hot in the look, studio and I feel like going okay. to sleep. All right, hang on a minute. Right. Hang on, hang on. Hang on. Stop That's real that. snoring. Just stop. Stop. Mm. All right, hang on. Hang on a minute. You're not ringing my boss, are you? Uh, I haven't got his number. Have you got his number? Not on me, no. This wasn't in the plan. I've got other things to talk about, but hang on a minute. Here we go. What are you doing? Let's see if the bosses are awake at this time of day. Hmm. This is totally slowing down the pace of this program. Well, I you do know that. What, don't what you? are you doing? Did you like your coffee, by the way? Yeah, thanks for interrupting in the middle of a very you important You said you wanted broadcast. a coffee, so I made you a coffee. That's two I've made you today. I bet he sends me to an answering machine. I'm going to ring every boss in this building until we get an answer. I'm not playing any music or talking to Miss Coventry until somebody answers their phone. Go away, Alex, I'm busy. Excuse... Cheek, did you hear that? Go away, Alex, I'm busy. Oh, what a rude man. How dare he? Right, well, I'll ring another one then. Why are you That's ringing all the bosses? I'm did just... Because I'm sick of you whinging. All right, well, look, look. Let's look, try look. another boss. Do you have the number for your boss? I do somewhere, but not in this room. I'll so. ring the MD next. This is exhausting. I've got so much to do. I've got Miss Coventry waiting. I wanted to talk to you about dating her. I'm now having to waste time with this. Let's see if this boss is listening. There's about 14 of them, isn't there, in this company? Can you can you bring me your bosses? Hello? Ah, oh, hello. Is that uh, Mr. Donald Douglas? Speaking. Hello. Uh, it's uh, Mr. Alex Belfield, the ugliest man on the radio. We're live on the air at the moment. How are we? Uh, how are you? I'm fine. Good. Um, I'm not. What's the problem? I'll tell you what the problem is, right? You've given me a news guy who sits here whinging and moaning on air. This is a very positive program, right? I'm very, very positive. You'll never hear any sarcasm or negativity on this program. And every chance Nick gets, he whinges and moans about the air conditioning. Now, who do I have to sleep with, including yourself, to get this issue... It's not me. No. You're no. not up for it, right. No. Is there any, who do you think would be willing to resolve this issue so that I don't have to put up with whinging and moaning 24-7? I think we should call an air conditioning engineer. Right, so who do I have to speak to to get that to happen? Oh, I can arrange that for you, Alex. Darling, you know, this is why this is why I love this. This man, Donald Douglas, is the man, right, who put me on the map. Before this, I was going to go to the Betty Ford Clinic in-house radio, Nick. And this man brought me in to save this radio station, and what a great job I've done. By the way, I'm sure you want to congratulate me on that. Oh, definitely, Alex. You see, you're a doer. That's what I love about you. When something happens, all I have to do is pick up the phone, whether it be at 3 o'clock in the morning, 10 o'clock at night, and you sort it out. This is all you needed to do, Nick. Instead of whinging and moaning for the last 20 weeks, why didn't you just phone Donald Douglas, the big man, and sort it out? Eh? Well, you've done it for me now, Alex, so thank you very much. What, what's going on in the background? That's all my fans. There's three of them. Can you believe this? How unprofessional, Don, that he's now got fans going in a radio studio. <laughs> I think it's time, time to play a song. By the way, yes, it is. And can I also make one other point? Of course. There's a man called Stephen who works in this place who allegedly is a boss, correct? I do believe so, yeah. He told me to bog off. He hadn't got time for me live on the air. Now, I think it's inappropriate. He's a very busy man. I don't care, I'm busy. Who's the most important man in this building, Donald? By me, of course. No, me! Bidding is now open on 80876. The lowest you need bid gets £10,000 cash this summer. So how low can you go? Wake up, wake up.